David, thanks. New information here at 4. An accused Oklahoma City drug dealer recently charged with murder makes a court appearance today. The victim died from a fentanyl overdose last year. News 9's crime tracker Jennifer Pierce has details of this nine-month-long investigation. The murder suspect's preliminary hearing was set for May 19th. Now, this is one of two recent fentanyl death cases. The Oklahoma City Police Street Narcotics Unit has been instrumental in prosecuting. The investigation into the death of 32-year-old Katherine Manning started last April at this Northwest Oklahoma City home. Manning's roommates found her unresponsive on a bed. They used Narcan on the victim and started CPR. Members of our street narcotics unit had, uh, they were called out to the scene to investigate, being that this was possibly related to drug or nar narcotic usage. Manning died an hour after arriving at St. Anthony Hospital. Police say Manning was one of 118 Oklahoma City residents to die by fentanyl overdose last year. The department's chief of police says that's why they now have a specialized unit to investigate. They go out um, and try to help those families through that process uh, of losing their loved one, but then also, too, trying to track down that dealer and find where that fentanyl's coming from. Through months of investigation, the street narcotics unit tracked down the alleged dealer who sold Manning $20 worth of fentanyl. Court documents revealed Manning and her two roommates met Justin Lastra at the Hemp Inn on South I-35. Investigators confirmed the details through phone records and video surveillance. During an interview, Lastra admitted to police he was a fentanyl dealer and sold the drug to Manning and her roommates. Lastra also told investigators he knew the drug was lethal. Police found large amounts of fentanyl and methamphetamine in Lastra's car. Ultimately, again, the investigators were able to connect that suspect to that victim's death to present charges of, of murder and also distribution. Investigators say the medical examiner listed Manning's cause of death as acute fentanyl toxicity. At the Oklahoma County Courthouse, Jennifer Pierce, Oklahoma's own News 9.